I, I think you should ask my staff about the level of consultation. Okay. As at this point, we know we've just been given last week diagrams of what their their terminal will look like. It is it has been done with all due respect by a Dutch airport consultant in consultation with KLA Consult, which is another company, and. If you look at the terminal that they come up with, you know, go and ask Connor after this. Okay, we were, it's, it's a th three-level airport. We would never, ever build something like this, ever, right? <coughs> and so I disagree on the consultation. There is generally a one-way discussion with MAB, uh, except for this terminal, there was a lot of consultation. It was a good partnership, but this new one we don't know anything about. We disagree with the area. There is no infrastructure in that area that they're talking about. So that's one. National Airport Plan. Okay, National Airport Plan. Um, uh, would require a lot of input from us, our growth numbers, etc. You know, why did I get to this stage if there was a National Airport? Right now, I haven't had a presentation from MAB. We just had one document here. This is what our national airport plan is. Only when we started um, with KLI East did suddenly this national airport plan come out. What is the cost of this? Has MAB, have you heard any number on the cost? I've been transparent. 1.6 billion. Has Malaysian airports given a figure for this airport? Who's going to pay for it? Ultimately, the airlines will have to pay for it. That's why we are objecting. Rough dates. The terminal plan that we saw will be a disaster. Has the ERL link been built? Has it been agreed? I spoke to ERL. They're like, they don't know. Right? Um, so. What consultation? I think you should at least say, this is what it's going to cost, this is what it's going to look like, you know, what's your views? None. Their consultant, we heard, said that our passenger forecast is too, it will never happen. What do you mean? We're the ones who are going to board the planes. <laughs> We've beaten the forecast every time. I have letters to show you that when they built this terminal, we said it's too small. MAB has said that we said that we wanted 10 million. <laughs> I, I show you the letter to say it's too small. Um, so I don't agree with that statement one bit. We haven't been consulted enough. A partnership is about consultation. Why should we be leaving if we're happy? Why? Why should we want to leave? As I said, it's the last thing we want to do. Yes, there will be detractors. There's been detractors to AirAsia from day one. I've had to fight to get KL Singapore. How can that need a fight? Mm. Cars can go there, buses can go there, mm. but AirAsia cannot. Mm. Cellcom can operate everywhere, Maxis can operate everywhere, Public Bank can operate everywhere, Maybank can operate everywhere, but AirAsia cannot. Explain that to me.